It is recommended that you create a new project for the uploaded station. Uploading a station to an existing project could cause a duplication of networks and addresses. Click the File menu, select New, and give the project a name. We will name this one Upload Project. Click OK. With the project level highlighted, select the PLC menu. Choose Upload Station to PG. Choose Slot 2 for the PLC. Click View to poll the accessible nodes. The CPU is selected. Click OK. The station begins uploading. Drop down to the Blocks folder. Reposition the uploaded project window. If you have an offline project, you can copy the symbol table and paste it to the uploaded project. Choose Yes to overwrite the existing empty symbol table. Select the Blocks folder and let's open a block. How about FB11? You will see a message saying there are no parameter and local variable names. That's because they are not stored in the PLC. Click OK. You will see a message telling you that this block does not contain symbol information. Click OK. Select the end local variable. In this view, you can see the local variables have lost their user assigned names. Let's close this block. Let's open another block. We'll choose FC16. Again, you will see the no parameter and local variable name message. Click OK. The no symbol message also displays. Select OK. Because we copied the symbol table over, any I.O. in the symbol list will be named. You will see that the data block 99 elements do not have symbol names. Close the block. Let's open data block 99. The no parameter and local variable name message displays. Click OK. The user defined names have been lost. While uploading a station is possible, be aware that you will not get parameter and local variable names in your blocks. Symbol names can be replaced by copying a new symbol table to the uploaded project. This concludes the video 